This hurts me. This young man is dead. He watched the news and they're saying maybe the police officer thought he was reaching for his taser. They showed some stuff on the news today where he had his taser out earlier, blah, 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 blah. This man is dead. And everybody knows my old saying, my motto is no man need die. Not a one. For the people who watch my channel and who watch my videos who understand the significance of human emotion and human's feelings, who understand this and understand it well, those who don't know me understand me and learn what the fuck I'm saying right the fuck now it is not sad enough that this man is dead but it is even more sad for people to believe by rising up against the police and running around and shooting police officers and killing police officers would bring somebody back from the death who was fucking killed wrongfully while being handcuffed laying face down face down hands behind your back shot in the back or wherever they shot him shot to death one shot there is no justice by going out and threatening this police officer's family. There's no justice boycotting. You don't get nowhere uprising and killing and tearing up shit. To believe another human being wants to say, okay, it's time to raise up and start killing cops. This is why I didn't want to do a video. This is why I don't want to be a voice sometimes. This is why I don't want to tell the people the truth. Because those who don't understand the significance of humanity quick to say, fuck it, let's just go kill more people. You are no better than the man who shot this man. You don't know what was going through his mind. You don't know if he was racist. You don't know if he did it because he's black. You don't know if he did it because he's scared. You don't know why he did it. So why in the fuck should you say, let's go kill more people? They said he was reaching for his taser gun. They showed video footage earlier today that the man had his taser pulled out. Then they showed other people with taser guns out. Has it ever occurred to anybody, maybe he pulled the taser out and gave the damn taser to some other cop, then was doing something else and reached for the only thing he felt on his body, which he thought was his taser, and killed his man. Regardless of that, regardless of what happened. I've said a million times, what if the police didn't have guns? What if the only people who had guns was the SWAT? So, what if whenever there was three police officers somewhere, then there'd be one with a gun? What if? What if this man did kill this man? Just fuck it. Bow! That don't mean you go out. You, you know the fuck I'm talking to. That don't mean you go out and find officer don't have nothing to do with it and roll up on him and blow him to the sack. Put him in the bag. That don't mean you go out and go kill somebody else. Where's the fucking humanity, man? What the fuck? Have you all gone fucking crazy? This man's God will sort his soul out. He is already dead. Don't send me the fucking police officers 
goddamn address. I'm not going to fucking tell nobody this man's address. He's already PC'd police custody. He fucked up. Somebody died for nothing. Let the shit go. Everybody want to march and ride on somebody. And what the fuck's going to happen when you sitting in a crowd and they run out of bean bags to shoot at you? What's going to happen, baby, when martial law is declared in the city of Oakland because a handful of people decide to shoot at the police? Control, baby. Control. They'll get theirs. The real law will take care of these people. An eye for an eye, a tooth for a tooth, a life for a life. This man is already dead. The man is going to change his name next. The man. His family is going to be whisked out of California next. Two wrongs don't make a right. An eye for an eye don't work. Because if that's the case, if an eye for an eye is what should actually have went down, if that's the case, how many family members you have have done some fucked up shit and when it comes down time for the eye to take the other eye what if your number pops up and you ain't got nothing to do with it don't excite people to go hurt and hurt nobody where where is it law an eye for an eye let's take this one step further an eye for an eye you're all dead then then we will all die we will all die anyway. But I'm not trying to have nobody rush my exit off this motherfucker on a fucking humbug. I'm not going to have a whole bunch of people listen to my words and take things out of context just because I bang on the damn drum. That don't mean those are the drums of war. Oscar need not die. And I'm not going to remit. I was going to do one more video about this. And I had the video footage. I've downloaded video footage off YouTube. I took some more footage off TV. And I put this together. And I was going to do this. But I'm not even going to fuck. I'm going to eat the button right now and fucking erase it. Because you're not smart enough. to compute the words the visions you can't comprehend what that video would have did you can't even begin to realize what probably would have happened because if you say go kill somebody over what I said last time. You probably would have went and did somebody over what I just erased. 